Hi everyone! In this video we will show you how to use DPI server capabilities in Geo 5 MX app. Today artificial intelligence technologies are very popular and widely used in all spheres of human life. Modern smartphones use artificial intelligence to identify owner's face. All popular social networks use augmented reality to make effects to photos and videos. Artificial intelligence technologies are used to identify different objects. So, video surveillance systems with AI can identify cars, people, animals, etc. We will show you capabilities of multifunctional REST server DPI. One of DPI features is image colorization. DPI image colorization service transforms black and white photo to color one YRP. So we see image colorization main page. Here is API of this service. We have here three parameters. Black and white photos URL. API key. And link to DPI image colorization service. To use this service in Delphi app, you should do post request with these three parameters. So, to use DPI, you should obtain RP key. First of all, you should sign up if you first use this service. Here you should type username, email, password, retype password and click sign up. Then you should check your email and go by link sent by DPI. We have account for DPI Colorizer. Just log in. You should copy and save obtained RP key for further using in the file. Also, for correct work of server, you should add billing information. Just type debit or credit card number, card tax predate, CVV. So, we have free trial limit of $5. In our Dell 5 MX app, we will send black and white image by post request and receive JSON response with URL link to our color image. To connect to remote DPI REST server in Embracadero Dell 5 FMX app, we will use Tinet HTTP request and Tinet HTTP client components from components palette itemnet. You should set property client to current Tinet HTTP request. Just set current client, Tinet HTTP client 1. Also, you should set property method string. Just type post. To show black and white image to user in our FMX app, we will use the image component from components palette shapes. To show color image to user, we will use the same the image component. To show JSON response from server, we will use the memo component from components palette standard.
To send parameters RP key black and white image URL by post request, we will use the following variables. So, variable object to name value pair header keeps RP key to send to our DPP server. The multipart form data class object L multipart form data keeps our black and white image passed to on our computer. So here is our black and white image. Pass to our black and white image is different on MS Windows and Android platforms. So string variable pass keeps pass to our black and white image file. On Windows we keep our image file on disk C. On Android, on external storage folder pictures. To load black and white image file into the image component, we will use load from file method. It takes variable pass as parameter. So on Android and on Windows platform. To send black and white image file to our RSDPAP server, we will use the NetHttp request post method. So post method takes URL link to server. It takes a multipart form data object, which keeps our black and white image file. LMS mem to memory stream class object. And header variable with our API key. LMS object keeps JSON response from server. We will show JSON response from server into memory component. We will use loads from stream method. JSON response of server keeps URL linked to our transformed color image. Output URL parameter. So to load color image, you should get URL link by passing JSON response from DPI colorizer. We will use JSON object, the JSON object class for passing. So in the result we will get URL link and save it to string variable colorized image pass. To load cover image from server we will use the net HTTP client components get method. Get method takes URL link to our color image from server and a response to memory stream object.
So our response gets the match from server for further showing to user by using the image component. To show a color image in our FMX app, we will use the image components load from Steam method. For correct work of our FMX app on Android platform, you should set user's permission to access to external storage and to access to internet. Project Options Uses Permissions Internet Permission is set and try text and storage. So let's run our app on Windows and Android platforms.